Are you ready for a fabulous shop with me? We are going to Costco because all of the holiday toys are out and now is the time to go scope them out and to see what you might need to find for your kids Christmas. You're gonna do a shop with me over at Costco for holiday toys. Hey, hey you guys, it's Christina from the Purple Alphabet. I love doing this video, it's so much fun. We're gonna head over to Costco and check out all of their holiday toys that they have out. They have some great deals, they have exclusives, they have some really fun things, they have some things from last year, and they have some new things. I'm gonna cover it all in this video. If you're new to the Purple Alphabet, make sure to hit subscribe. We got lots of fun things coming up in upcoming videos. We do educational activities for kids, ideas and inspirations to learn through play, but then we also do a fabulous holiday gift guide every November. November and there's giveaways, lots of giveaways. And I don't want you to miss out on that. So make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications so you don't miss it. There is a ton of ideas to show you over at Costco. So we're gonna head on over there, get started right away. The toy section is filled with things, you guys. So if you see something you like, make sure you go and get it because although the shelves are filled now, they will sell out quickly. We're gonna start off with some Hexbug. Hexbug is an amazing brand. They have these kits every year. There are three inside of here and they are STEM kits and building robotics. This set is $30, split them up, you have multiple gifts. If you're into superheroes, there's this great play school play set for the heroes, comes with the characters and some vehicles for $17. American Girl, this is the greatest place to buy American Girl dolls because you get the dolls, you get the accessories and they have some really great finds, a couple of different styles and dolls as well. These sets that I'm showing you right now come in three different sets. Camille is my favorite. Her dress is so cute. And if you want to score this with all of the accessories, this is going to be $99.99. If you like Magformers magnet sets, which I do, you can score this package for $30. It has 41 pieces plus wheels in here, so you can make some vehicles with your Magformers, amongst other things. I'm a big believer in Magformers, so I love these. Slimy Goop, if you allow slimy in your house and a kinetic sand. This kit is for you. There's all kinds of little molds and stamp rollers. This is $15. Every year we see these two. They are little stem kits. This is an off-road racer. They come two to a pack. This one also has the monster truck. You can also get the other one, which has like a little bit different color, so it uses gears. These are 20 bucks. Split them up for two gifts. Really like this machine maker. It's for the younger kids, three and up, where you build your own truck, so you get a little screwdriver and wheels. This is $16. And then for $17, your really young ones, your toddlers, ages two and up, can get this great truck, and it has a lot of things that you can do like unscrewing and screwing things, a little storage container on there. You can drive around the car. Really like this. It's teaching you shapes and colors and tools and fine motor skills, hand-eye coordination. It's a score. If you have a Hot Wheels fan, they have this great set with some Hot Wheels and the truck that goes along with it. So you can transport all of your cars in style. This set's really, really cute. It is $20. Do you have anybody in your family who's into Marvel? Love these remote control cars, especially for the preschoolers because they're so easy to control. $19 and you get your choice. And if you like the little push and go carts, they have a great set of superheroes too. This set that comes with a little bit more is $15. They have this every year, the Play-Doh 50 pack. This is gonna be $10. And then Squeezimals is new this year, these little plushes. And they have a surprise one, a mystery one in each pack. This one is $25. And at the stores, they're about four to five dollars each. Bitty Baby, another American girl find. Look how adorable this baby is. She is so cute and lifelike and realistic. It's $80, but you also get the little carrying seat to go along with it. So you have a little toy to play with, the doll and the feeder with. And then we also have the camping tent for $70, which is really cute too. Another fun find. And if you're into Barbies, we have this set of Barbie mermaids, which is really cute. Also comes with a little girl and it looks like a unicorn for $30. And a couple of other accessories are included in this kit too. Love the Legos at Costco. They have quite the selection right now. So we have the Lego Cities, which is for ages five and up. There's a couple different styles you can choose from. This one is $40. They also have a little bit cheaper price point at $15, which are these two-in-one kits, ages five and up, and you can choose from the Super Pack here or this monster truck and helicopter. This one is a score. $39 will get you the Lego City flying helicopter with a little big rig on it. A lot of minifigures in 
this one too. And then for $75, they have the airport, an airplane, which I thought was super adorable. Or you can get the little emergency police station set up. Now for $40, if you don't like the kits and you like to build on your own, you can get the plain Lego set, which has tons of Legos in different colors. Trolls World Tour dolls, if you are into the Trolls movies, $15. More American Girl dolls, we have Blair, which is, she's so adorable in her little dress. And Luciana, which is the astronaut astronomy one. Another really great doll for $120. LOL dolls, we had some of these last year, a little bit different this year. This set is $20, but we have another set, which is the four in one glamper with 60 surprises inside. You can't even see what's inside of here. There's a lot of surprises on this one and it's $100. This two pack comes with 40 surprises and they are not showing you at all what's inside of here. So if you're into the LOLs, this might be one you want. Really like this dollhouse, you guys, really well made. It's from the Kid Craft Band. It is a treehouse retreat mansion. It comes with the accessories as well. It's $150. These always go super fast. So if you need a dollhouse, go get this one now. Welly Wishers has this really cute vehicle to drive your doll around or for your doll to drive another American Girl brand. Also comes with some clothing and accessories with it as well. This Barbie set has two dolls inside of it and two vehicles. So we have the helicopter and the convertible. This one is about $43. This little set of games is really great. There's a whole bunch of card games inside of here. Uno, Dose, Bold, Pick, Flip, some games I haven't tried yet. Pictionary too, for $19, you could split those apart and have several gifts. Don't forget to check out the book section because you're gonna find a lot of things there, especially if you're a homeschooler, you're gonna love the book section right now. I'm gonna start off with the science collection. This, these are like reference books for your middle schoolers and up, and they look pretty in depth. And by subject, look how detailed, it's more of a reference style book, which would be great to have on your bookshelf. Good Night Stories for the Rebel Girls. I am unfamiliar with this, but it looked really interesting. If you know anything about this, let me know in the comments. I really liked all of these books. We have physics, electricity, chemistry. So they have a book inside, but not only that, when you open them up, they have all things that you need to do these activities inside. This would be great as an elective or something to complement a homeschool study. Who doesn't like Where's Waldo? Look at this, there are six Where's Waldo books in here. My childhood is coming back. Lots of fun on this if your kids like those seek and find kind of things. We have a Wizarding World book that is a combination with Lego for all of the Harry Potter fans out there. And then let's get into all of the chapter books. So these are book sets and Costco is known for having some great selections on book sets. These are the larger ones that I found. So they're going to be more expensive because they're the hardcover, but they are great to add to any library, especially if your child likes the author. So we have a couple of these before in the past. You can also find the easy readers in book sets as well. These are really great price for those early readers if you want something to start off with and they're just starting to read books. These are great, although my store didn't have quite the selection they normally do. These Disney ones are great too. They're five minute stories, so they're great for before bed if you want something nice and short and they're all kind of that Disney theme. And I really thought these were interesting. This one's called Trailblazing Men and they have books inside about all of these people here on the cover. They also have have a women's one and then they have one for artists and writers. I'm not quite sure the age range is on this one because all of them were sealed up so you'll have to let me know. But I do know this one is for babies, a musician book learning about all the favorite musicians in these different genres which is really cute. I think these are board books. I wanted to quickly kind of breeze through some of the other books that they had, the chapter books for their early readers, kind of the elementary age. They have quite a selection, so always check here first, especially if you want to get the whole box set. They even have ones for babies, which I think is pretty cool. So you're going to find some great things, plus they make excellent gifts. Some of these I'm unfamiliar with and I'm kind of curious what they are like, but I have a feeling if they're at Costco, they're probably pretty popular. Anybody read the zombie collection? I kind of want to check that out too. I'm just going to skim past all these and so you guys can have a look at what was in my Costco. The Magic Tree House is also a favorite. Definitely like this series. And of course the Junie B. Jones is also a very popular one. We have several of these books in our house and that is a great price for 14 books.
I really like how they're doing the world record books right now. I remember when these used to be black and white paperbacks, but now they're super engaging, filled with a lot of facts and interesting things about records being broken around the world. This is a really fun book, especially for those kids who are really interested in record breaking. This was kind of a fun find, everything you need to know about English or math, another great reference book. This is more for your middle schooler because of the topics covered. However, it's a great resource book and it really looks and feels like something fun to read. So these would be good to have. They have one in English and one in math and they cover a variety of subjects. And if your child has a question about something or a topic, they can probably refer back to these books. Let's talk a little bit about the baby books. We have some really fun flip the flap books that are also pop up. Really like these, especially for those toddlers. They really enjoy flipping the flaps as you read through the books. And these are really cute. If you like the ones that are interactive where you push the buttons and they make a sound as you read, they have a really good series from Discovery on this and a couple different styles too. There's a zoo one here where you find the picture and then you push the button and you get to hear what that animal says or that sound at the construction site. If you like Disney trivia, this one's a talking quiz book. So there's over 200 questions inside this book. And then you have this little keypad at the side where, where you can push it to see if you get the answer right. They even had one for the Disney princesses. It's a really fun take. It kind of reminds me of Trivial Pursuit. Okay, we love these books at our house. Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? And Polar Bear too. These are a great find. They come three to a pack. And then we have some really fun board books here. These weren't open, so I couldn't show you, but there's a steam train book here. One about tractors and one about a fire engine. If you like seek and finds, this one's a lot of fun. 101 dinosaurs where you have to actually find the dinosaurs in the book. So if you have a preschooler who's into dinosaurs, they're gonna love this one. And history books. If you're doing a homeschool chapter on ancient Egyptians, check out these. They're really informative, they're colorful, they're interesting. I really think they're a lot of fun. And they also had one on they also had one on ancient Greeks and also pirates. These are more in depth and they are called treasure chest, middle ages or ancient Rome. So you have your textbook right in front, but then in the very back, after you read through all of the colorful pages, there's a little packet there full of materials to do your own activities and additional learning. The Middle Ages one is exactly the same, just a slightly different topic, but look how colorful these pages are. It'll be a lot of fun to learn when you're learning about these times in history. I'm just going to quickly glaze over some of the books that they have available right now. There are a ton of popular tiles right now on even Shel Silverstein, which is a great one from my childhood. I was really excited to see it here. They have two different books from this author. And then I really thought these were fun for your earth conscious kids. This one's notes about living on planet earth, about sustainability, about our planet and how it works. And then they also have one for how we can plan for the future and how we live now. I wanted to show you a few more books. Some of these are board books. Some of these are picture books, but they have a really good selection and any of these are gonna make a great gift, especially this one right here. It's called I Like Myself, which is a really great book about diversity, being different and embracing that. A Lift the Flap Earth book. This one was kind of fun. I always like the Lift the Flap ones. This one is actually probably for maybe your kindergartner to second grader. There's a lot of facts in this book, but it's kind of fun to lift the flaps. So if you have a kid who loved Lift the Flaps as a preschooler, they're definitely gonna like this because there's a lot more facts inside this one. They even had one on bugs, which I thought was really cute. It kind of covered all of the bugs where you can flip the flap and learn even more. They did have a section of Christmas classics, which is a lot of fun because if you like all of those good stories and right before Christmas, you're gonna find one of your favorites here. Some of these are new to me and some of them we actually have on our shelf. This one was pretty interesting. It is the Crayon Christmas. So it looks like it's an extension of one of the crayon books, but in the very back, there's this envelope, which isn't open, so I can't show you, but I can tell you right here, it talks about what's inside. So that's kind of a fun element and there are letters inside from the crayons. These are fun. This is a book about telescopes. So it talks about all the ways that you use telescopes. And then in the very back, you can actually make your own. So it has these materials inside that you can do your own projects with. This looks like a 
lot of fun. And then they even had one that was for microscope. So the exact same concept where inside it talks about using the microscope and how microscopes are used throughout the world. And then in the very back, there is a little pouch filled with the materials to make your own microscope that actually works with a three times magnification. My eye was caught on these little activity pouches. They had Paw Patrol, they had some other characters too, but they had Lisa Frank. Lisa Frank was huge when I was a kid, so my eye totally caught this one, and it has so many activities inside of it. It was a lot of fun. I don't know if my kids would be that interested in Lisa Frank, but it definitely was popular when I was younger. Okay, you guys, this one is a jackpot. It's from Pretty Books. Love Pretty Books, but look at everything you get inside this gift set. This is amazing. The price is perfect. These books are great. So I really like how they have it all set up. Everything's included for you, and you can cover a lot of topics with these. Here's a little bit on the back of what's included inside. Each one of these books is like six, seven, eight dollars each. They had one set that was for babies. These are board books inside of this one so we have colors one two threes toys animals and these are so colorful and so pretty kids love these and then they had one for zoo animals this one had a little bit of a mix of different things too: lift the flap push the button board books inside this and a deal even if you buy it and take it apart and have separate gifts this is still a great value a fun on the go item are these sticker activity books where they have blank scenes and you put the stickers inside of them they had two different styles at my store these are great for activity kits these are great to put inside the seat back pocket of your car just to pull in when you need something for the kids to do really quick Highlights are these amazing learning packets that I haven't seen before. I found some for kindergarten and first grade, and inside are books for 15 minute lessons. I couldn't see inside of these, so if you own this, please tell me what you think of it. But here's a little glimpse of the kind of content that's in there on the book spines. You're covering a lot of topics on here, and it looks like they're really short and condensed lessons. These books have been here for a while. We've used one of them and have really enjoyed them. They're great for different ages. I think there's kindergarten and preschool in here, maybe first grade and second grade, and they have activity pages inside. The Brain Quest workbooks, though, are some of our favorites. They had up to six sixth grade on these and they're great workbooks really fun and interactive I like the artwork and they're really quick too they don't take a lot of time to do and I like that on every page it's something different it's not the same activity on every other page and of course the price is pretty good on these two and don't forget to head over to the office section because that's where I found these. They're called dashboards, but they're by Bookie Board, which is something I've shown you in a purple alphabet gift guide before in the past, where you write on it and you push a button and it erases. The kids love these, but these are over in the office section, so be sure to check over there if you don't see them with the toys, because this is also a deal too. And it's actually even fun for adults, which is how they're marketing this one as kind of a message system. So don't forget to check the office section. Section two. Have you found something amazing at Costco that I might have missed? I need to know about it. Let me know down below in the comments so that I don't miss it. Also, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to watch out for the Purple Alphabet Holiday Gift Guide coming in the month of November. I think it's gonna start on a Wednesday. And make sure to give me a thumbs up to show your love.